We got Reggie. Okay, great. You got the headset here? Yeah. Reg. Reggie. Right here. Yeah, that's a good one. There you go, Reg. Nice going, bud. Thank you. Hey, man. Hey, were you surprised that you got that wide open look yes. on that play? Yes. I was like, I, I was really surprised. Man, I was too. <sighs> oh. We're going to try to call that play up for you, Reg. Okay. 30 back? Okay. Here's your uh, levels right here, Reg. 30 seconds. Got gotcha. you. Okay. Okay. We got an out back promo over there. Okay, thank you, Jeff. Got to get it back in me. <laughs> <laughs> you can say something about that if you want. <laughs> well, it's nice to see that because it's been a long time since 1991 that the Pacers won a game at the Garden, and they do it tonight, 94 to 90. A regular season game, I should point out. They, of course, won of the. Uh, in the postseason play, and one of the reasons why tonight was Reggie Miller with a sensational game of 27 points tonight, and Reg has been refueling himself here with, <laughs> with something. A little ammo. Put little it back Mino, in there, buddy. Yes, I got to put it back in my body. How big was this game to the ball club? Oh, uh, you know, words cannot explain how big this game was. We're trying to catch New York, and now we're a half a game behind them for the overall best record in the East. So, you know, coming into this game, it, it was really weird because our shoot-around wasn't the same. It was almost like a playoff atmosphere shoot-around. We went over little things, little details that we haven't been very successful here in, in years past. And uh, guys were really focused, and uh, we just came out and played well. Talk a little bit about that game-winning shot you were able to knock down. Were you surprised? I mean, I looked at the replay, and I couldn't believe that you got so wide open. I mean, Antonio set a decent screen, right. but Starks just was late getting to you. Well, to tell you the truth, I was really surprised because John had been doing a good job up to that point when I was coming off screens, and uh, every time I would turn, he would be right there, so it was making my shots uh, difficult. But I was coming off my favorite side to the right. I almost wish I would have came off that side <laughs> last May uh, <laughs> in Game 7, but he forced me off the other way last uh, year. But um, – and then you, you know, had eyes for somebody there. Uh, the whole front row. <laughs> <laughs> Reg, what, what Clark and I talked about was that's a play that we run all the time. That's a regular in our arsenal. Right. They didn't seem to defend that at all. Well, what I was really surprised is usually they, uh, New York likes to run a stunt where the big man likes to show a lot mm -hmm. and then get back mm -hmm. to his man. Mm -hmm. Um, Antonio did a good job of kind of holding. I don't know if that was uh, Mason or Ewing, but he did a good job of holding so he couldn't stunt. And I saw Starks trying to flop to get a foul, but the referees aren't going to call a foul with that much time on the clock in the game on the line. And um, I had missed some earlier wide-open jump shots, and I said, oh, man, if I miss this one, I ain't going to be able to go back to Indy. So. <laughs> Reggie, one quick final question. Uh, Clark and I admired the, the way that Derek McKee very quietly was a consistent factor throughout the ball game. Today. Well, he's been doing it all year for us, and uh, this is always a tough matchup when he has to come in here and play Charles Smith and Anthony Mason, and those guys are much bigger and much bulkier than he is, but quietly – but surely he goes about and does his business. And now we're ready to go home and hopefully right, try buddy. to get Washington and try to get in this race a little bit, All baby. Right. Sounds Th good. Thanks for coming out, Reg. I Thank know it's you. always a big win in New York City for you. Yes. Reggie Miller with an outstanding game tonight. By the way, some of our guests on tonight's game broadcast received dinner down under at the Outback Steakhouse. We'll take a short break and return to the Garden in New York City, where the Indiana Pacers have picked up the victory by the score of 94-90 to 90 tonight.